It's a public art piece and if you can imagine it's a cement sofa which you can sit on and it's decorated with mosaic tiles. So they have to be added in together and that makes up the glue. And about five years ago we focused on arts and older people and it's because that we feel that's been a neglected area in the past. There's been lots of concentration on children and young people but not on older people and it's a really vital part of older people's lives and can immensely benefit their mental and physical well-being. So what you can do, you can do, you can do a wee line down this way. Well, I actually um, go to Holland a lot and um, years ago I actually came out of a train station and just seen this beautiful sofa and had a look at it and seen what way it was done and I thought, oh, I'd like that. We're looking for um, an increase in engagement with older people who have never um, tried or dabbled in the arts before. We're looking for um, the fact that they are doing some art, that they will want to continue that and carry it on. Uh, we want to see that by doing these projects that they are actually having fun, which improves health, which brings a smile to their face. A lot of our ideas came from maybe working when they were younger, childhood street games, interests, going to the cinema, all different things. So from that, we progress to our design. So now we just are going to work at our own place, socialising. The whole idea is just to do it in your own time and to have fun with it, putting the tiles on. In probably about three months' time, Ben will be coming from Holland and he'll be grouting the sofa and finishing it off. And eventually we'll launch it and we'll have um, anybody who wants to come to celebrate with us. Yes, I, I think that's actually a good idea. Do the answer good? As always, the funding is very, very hard to come by, but in the bigger scale of things, when we look at public art, a lot of the times it's maybe taken from people who don't actually live here. So this is done by local people, local artists, and also um, it's going to be staying local. And it's projects um, with good news stories like this one that will help us try and uh, secure money and funding in the future to keep it running. I think this sofa is a completely amazing idea. I've never seen one uh, like that before. I think it's wonderful that it's been really participatory uh, piece of work that everyone's uh, been involved in, everyone's contributed their ideas to. It's really got an idea of the Shankill. It's got re representation and images of that. And I love the idea of it being a social space and people being able to relax and talk to each other on it. Perfect.